What if I tell you, you can cook your holiday centerpiece roast days in advance with sous vide? During the holidays, day of, day before, there's so many things going on in the kitchen. But front load all the work for an amazing, tender, juicy centerpiece roast, and all you have to do is reheat it for a fraction of the time. So during the first part of sous vide, you're essentially just setting your water bath to your desired temperature doneness, and you're heating your meat all the way up to it. By keeping the bath at that temperature and extending the cook time, that's when you're going to be converting that hard collagen to really tender gelatin. But a tough cut, like a ham, brisket, or even turkey, that's just what you want because that's what unlocks an amazing, tender, juicy texture. So the process is, pick your recipe, whatever centerpiece you want. So once you have your recipe, you're going to cook it through. So it's a tough cut, that's going to probably take anywhere from 8 to 24 hours. Once it's done cooking, you're going to transfer it to an ice bath. So the ice bath's at 40 degrees Fahrenheit or so. You're gonna keep it fully submerged for about one to two hours while agitating the ice water. That's gonna help rapidly chill it. From there, you're gonna transfer it to the fridge. It can sit in the fridge for a couple days, up to a week. When it comes time to reheat it, you're gonna set your water bath five degrees Fahrenheit lower than the original cooking temp. We've already tenderized it. We don't need to cook it anymore. All we're doing is reheating. How long does it take to reheat? Well, it could take one to six hours depending on the dimensions and thickness. Turkey legs, for example, those only take about two to three hours to reheat. But compared to the 24 hours that you've already put into it in advance, that's nothing. So it'll make your reheating day of for your centerpiece a lot easier and a lot more of a breeze when you have a ton to juggle. Once your roast, turkey, soon to be centerpiece is reheated sous vide, all you need is a final sear in a pan or blast in the oven to crisp the skin or develop a nice crust. So this is why sous vide is an amazing technique for unlocking a great holiday centerpiece roast. We have all the sous vide recipes and more at chefsteps.com. We have prime rib, herb crusted, we got honey glazed ham, we got our amazing turkey recipe. So this holiday season, let's reheat our centerpiece and have fun cooking. Subscribe to our channel and visit ChefSteps.com for more tips, recipes, guides, and tools to help you level up in the kitchen.